this is the presentation of this meal. It's a lot of food, but I promise you it's really, really good. Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. My name is Michael. Today I'll be making Italian chicken for dinner. Uh, with that, I serve it with rice, beans, and some tostones. And that is probably one of my wife's favorite dishes. When I tell her I'm, I will make that this weekend, it is a longer process than what more normal cooking would be, but uh, it's definitely amazing. The chicken will taste sweet, it'll be tender, and it'll just be amazing. Um, the chicken that I use is chicken breast. I usually like to fillet, I usually like to fillet them and then cut them like in slices, big, you know, thick enough for you to actually be satisfied when you're gonna chew it down. And um, yeah, so let's go ahead and get right to it. And whenever I actually uh, cut these chicken breasts, I like to cut off like the fat that they come with because I'm not a big fat guy. Well, I am, but I don't like, you know, the fat from the animal or whatever it is that I'm eating, whatever, whichever meat. That's what she said. What? You said something? Just like that, guys. Slices. They don't have to be too big, they don't have to be too small. It's just enough for when you go to um, put them inside the pan that would all fit. So, yeah. Now this, this meal right here, or this preparation with the chicken and how to cook it, uh, was shown by my brother, my, my big brother. And um, when I went to his house one time, it was a couple years ago, it was before me and Shimoy got together. Uh, he pretty much showed me the way he cooks his chicken in a different way. So you use the Italian dressing to pretty much like fry the chicken. Um, it turns into a grill, so to speak, but you can say it's being fried pretty much, but I think it's being grilled, really. I'm just using the, the grease or the, uh, the oils off the Italian dressing in order for me to actually cook the chicken all the way through. And I usually like to cook it until I see it white or a little brown. I don't mind a little burn to it. This is pretty good. All right, now I'll go ahead and clean them since I already got them in the bowl. I have some leftover Italian from the last time I made it. Again, Italian dressing is what you will use to cook it. And I'll just go ahead and uh, I'll put this on top of the chicken right now so it can actually kind of like marinate. And then uh, I'll go ahead and add like garlic powder and um, maybe even some onion powder just to actually uh, get some more flavor to it. All right, and then I'll leave that there for about 20 minutes to actually marinate. I should have done it last night, but I didn't. Uh, just kind of got sidetracked with something else. Um, for the meantime, I'll just go ahead and uh, probably start prepping the tostones. But all right, so I let the chicken marinate for about 20 minutes now. And now I'm gonna go ahead and start getting the rice prepped. And I'm gonna start boiling the beans. So I can have both of those ready. And in the meantime, I'll be cutting up the plantains while the chicken is cooking at the same time. So I like to cook at about medium to medium high, just because uh, I'm not trying to cook it fast, but I think that's the, the best way for me. So there goes my salt. I like to put the salt inside the water with the plantain so it can start soaking up all that good stuff in there. Dump the Italian dressing in there. Now that the oil is semi pretty hot, I go ahead and dump all the, uh, as much chicken as I can dump in here so they can start cooking. You see? Let it cook there. You'll come in, and you'll flip them. Like so. Just flip them. All I gotta say is I'm glad my dad came the day that he did because I was able to get some sofritos. So I'm gonna go ahead and put this inside the beans so I can get some good flavors to it and some tomato sauce and it's good to go doing some pinto beans instead. Pretty sure it's gonna come so I might as well go ahead and put this out there. If you see that the Italian dressing is actually drying up, go ahead and put some more, it doesn't hurt. That's the whole process. The Italian dressing is gonna actually dry up a lot faster so you would want to actually add more so you can actually keep cooking the chicken through. I mean, you got a whole batch going on for, I don't know, a family of five, family of eight, 
you know, just keep putting the Italian dressing and it'll actually uh, come out to be a lot better. So don't be scared to do that. So, sorry I didn't show you guys the, uh, the commotion of putting these tostones, these plantains inside the oil, but uh, it was popping. The oil was definitely popping. So I'm just gonna go ahead and squeeze these up. Make them into tostones because wife loves them. And she was able to find this little thing. Now this is a lifesaver when you actually do this because it's a lot easier. But if you don't have one of these, it's easy to use just, uh, my friend George showed me this one. He uses a plastic bag and you put it under like a cup. So when you go to squeeze it down, it doesn't get stuck at the cup. It'll just kind of like slide off the plastic bag. But after a couple uses, it'll just burn through the blood of the bag. So just be careful with that. You have one, you put it in. Put this down. And you squeeze. Just that easy. And then, it'll come out looking like that. What I did there, I just put some olive oil on top of it so it won't actually stick when I go to put the next one or the others. That is so good. I promise you, you're gonna enjoy it. Some tostones. Oof. We're about to have a feast. That's right. This is the presentation of this meal. There's a lot feed of food, me. but I promise you it's really, really good. She said feed me. All right, guys. So that was it for me for Monday. I had me uh, in this time around. Made some, uh, like I said, rice, beans, tostones, and some chicken, Italian dressing chicken. And it is. Mm. Oh my God. No beans are actually bomb. I ain't gonna front. Those beans are actually bomb. Anyways, you guys wanna see more? Make sure you guys leave me a comment, leave me a like, and subscribe to my channel for more. See you guys.